Hello, welcome back. This is Coinpig. So, today the Royal Mint released a series of coins, there's four in total, celebrating the life and work of Rosalind Franklin. Rosalind Elsie Franklin was born on the 25th of July, 1920, so almost exactly 100 years ago. So here we are. These are the coins released by the Royal Mint today. So there are four of them. Now you can see that there is a gold version, a brilliant uncirculated, and two silver versions. One Yefa and one standard silver. She was an English chemist and x-ray specialist and basically this work commemorates her work on DNA, particularly photo 51. So this is the gold version. This is the coin you can see in the box. It's a standard Royal Mint issue a gold coin. £1,075. There are 250 of this particular coin. There's the box. There's the specifications. No surprises, really. The fact that there are only 250 is quite low. I suspect it's because of the profile of the, the uh, person it celebrates that the number is so low. But yeah, this is the, the gold coin to celebrate Rosalind Franklin. So let's have a look at the, the next one in the series. This is the silver PA4. This is £95. There are 1,500 of these coins. In this presentation, it's uh, basically the same design, obviously in silver. Photograph 51 is mentioned. This is the specification. And obviously DNA is showing at the bottom of the name. Again, the box. And as you can see, that this is the same sort of design as the Stephen Hawking coin that was issued last year. Again, as I said, £95 for that coin. So let's have a look at the other silver coin. This is £55, this particular one. This is the standard silver, if you like. £3,500 in this limited edition. Slightly more in the coin mintage figures, 4,195. Not quite sure why there's 195 there, not 200 or whatever, but I should probably, I should probably have looked at, to find the, the reason for that. But this is the design. Rosalind Franklin, DNA, photograph 51. This is the actual representation of the photograph 51. And then the brilliant uncirculated. This is £10 as usual, there's no limited edition on these. Again, the same design. Of course, the Queen's portrait comes on all of these. Nothing, nothing different about this particular one, I don't think. It does, it does come with educational packaging. There's the Queen's portrait, and there's the reverse of the packaging, just to give you the specifications and a bit of uh, information about Rosalind Franklin. I should say David Napton is the designer of this uh, coin, or the reverse of this coin. So there are the four different coins in this series. I think there are fewer than they would be normally, but uh, yeah, when I was recording this, there wasn't much of a queue. I do have this queuing system, but uh, there wasn't much of a queue. So that generally has an indication as to how many are going to be sold. I mean, they're in sufficiently low numbers that I think they will probably 
sell out eventually. Uh, certainly the higher price too. But PA fronts aren't as popular, so you know, you never know. We'll, we'll see. Perhaps I'll give you an update later if I if I can remember to do that. And uh, yeah, this is the the new Rosalind Frank Franklin. I can't even say the name. This is the new Rosalind Franklin coin series. I'll probably order one, at least one of these coins, and uh, I'll do a review. So Photo 51 is an X-ray, essentially, of DNA. It was actually taken by Raymond Gosling, a graduate student working under supervision of Rosalind Franklin, in May 1952 at King's College, London. But this coin, or series of coins, is here to celebrate the mind and the work of Rosalind Franklin, who sadly died aged just 37 on the 16th of April 1958. After finishing her work on DNA, Rosalind Franklin also did some pioneering work at Birkbeck College on the molecular structures of viruses. You can find one of the English Heritage famous blue plaques celebrating the life and work of Rosalind Franklin at Drayton Gardens in South Kensington where she used to live but um, thanks for tuning in thanks for watching I'll see you back next time take care